All right, here we are raccoon hunting. In the woods of Arizona. You gotta look like a raccoon. If you want to catch a raccoon. Yes. That's how you sneak up on raccoons. Yeah, because they see you and they think you're friendly. They're like, that guy knows where some food is. He has not missed many meals. Yeah. Let's follow him yeah, to the food. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, we got a, a lot of comedy to talk about because uh, we... Uh, we're in uh, the Panhandle. Yeah, of in, Florida. In Pensacola. We did Back Porch Comedy, it's Back called. Porch. It's hard to find, Back yes. Porch. Because it's not on a porch. It's not in the back. It's a basement bar of a hotel. They should have called it Basement Hotel Comedy. Yes. Yeah, and that was okay. It wasn't that was great. Okay. It was yeah. okay. Yeah, we had good sets, though. We yeah. both did good. Yeah. Then from there, we went on to... We went on to uh, Mobile. Mobile. Alabama. Alabama. They have comedy in Alabama. The Blind Mule, it was called. It looked like a fatur- attic... In a fraternity house. That's right. Didn't see anybody who was blind. Didn't see any mules. Saw a couple <laughs> pictures. But uh, there was a drunk high guy behind the bar. Nice yes, guy. Nice guy. Did and some county there. Hannibal Burris was there a couple weeks Just before Just before we us. Were. We are chasing Hannibal. Yes, that's what it seems like. Yeah. And uh, then we left there and mm. went to... The Waffle House. The Waffle House. In Mobile. The, the coolest Waffle House employees in the history of Waffle House. The A-team. It was a setup. Yeah. It was just entertainers pretending to work at the Waffle House. Basically, yeah. At 1 a.m., serving breakfast, yeah. singing, and dancing. Singing and dancing, yeah. The A-team? Alan, Alan, Amber, and Angela. Really cool people. Yes. Shout out to them. And then after that, uh, we performed... In New Orleans. New Orleans. Never yes. been there. That was kind of Knowledge. interesting. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. The the Howling Wolf, Yep. it Howling was called. Yeah. And Hannibal was there also. That's they right. Said, like a month earlier. Right. So we that's what he said. We're following Hannibal Burris. Right. And they had howling women howling yeah. from the stairs of New Orleans. Yes. Running visitors. Yeah. Apparently <laughs> we looked friendly. Yes. <laughs> We did yeah. not visit. No, we did not visit. No, we did, no. performed in New Orleans. Had great sets actually in New Orleans. Had yeah. a lot of fun. Yeah. That was a good town. A lot good of fun town. there. A lot of fun. Then we left New Orleans mm. and crossed the border. To Texas. Houston, Texas, right on the border. Who knew? Never been there before. Yeah. That was kind of neat. Yeah, it's an industrial town. Yeah. yeah it's not it's a lot of oil. A lot of oil. Who knew? A lot of oil, yeah. Who thought Texas had oil? Yeah, we didn't know. Performed in uh, Houston at... Uh, um, do you remember the place? I don't either. Yeah. Secret Group. Oh, yes. The Secret, the secret group. group. Yes, and uh, was that that was when you were sick. Yeah, no, that well, I got the sick first after night. that. The that was San Antonio. Time. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. I got sick. I saw, got sick because of Houston. Yeah. <laughs> Left Houston, went to San Antonio. I had to perform alone. Yes. I met Abby. I met Abby, who uh, turned you on to the next place that we performed at. You had a really good set, you said. Right. I did. Yeah. And then we uh, had a, a good set the next night, both of us. And, and that was another secret group, wasn't it? Yeah. It was in the basement of a children's restaurant. We were telling dirty jokes in the basement yeah, yeah. of a, a children's, children's restaurant. restaurant. Yes, that was and a novel. We weren't sure if we were supposed to, if we could be within three hundred yards of the. That's... <laughs> yes, the children upstairs. We don't know. Yeah, we or... weren't. They were magnifying our voices on the amp, but who know where the yeah. I, children upstairs? I don't know. And before the show, they did that cool podcast. Really cool. One of the yeah. best podcasts I've ever seen. They had a three person uh, staff yeah. running it, but then there was audience participation. Yeah, they had a microphone off to the side. You can get up and. Talk and what they each had a different subject. Access. Access. Yeah, look them yeah. up. Podcast. Really, really cool. Out of San Antonio. San Antonio. Very good sets there. And then we went westward to El, El Paso, Paso, Texas. El Paso, Texas, where we were the minority. Fifteen percent white population yes. in El Paso. Buenos dias, El Paso. Yeah. But fun fact, it's one of the three safest cities in America. It was. We felt very safe. Yeah. Except all those. Even though they told us not to go north of where we were. Yeah, I don't know. Some of those white people hanging around the corners at night look kind of sketchy. Yeah, right. I was a little bit worried about that. We kept getting pulled over. <laughs> what are you doing being white and yeah. driving down the yeah, street? Right. You shouldn't be here. Yeah, you guys don't belong. <laughs> what? Get out of here. We don't feel safe with the white people around. <laughs> so that was San Antonio. El Paso. El Paso. <laughs> San Antonio. El Paso. That was El Paso. It was Texas, man. Yeah, it was Texas. Texas. A lot of Texas. Texas yeah. is very big. Texas is very big. Yeah, big. Don't mess with Texas. They give you big black eyes. All right. Speaking of black eyes, are we almost done? Yeah. This should uh, clean off our port. Oh, uh, you know what? This was my fungus cream. Really? Oh, dude, I'm sorry. Oh, dude. We should probably take this off. 